Buenos dias Magic Gang, welcome back to another video and today we got more Mexican food and you know what, it's actually Monday so we're celebrating Mexican food Monday which is my new, newest holiday it's, it's a thing, if you didn't know, now you know anyways, I went to a new Mexican restaurant that I have not been to called Taqueria Tapatio number 2 Tapatio out uh, even though I do have Valentina on deck. El Pastor burrito, we got breakfast burrito, we got carne asada burrito, we got bean and cheese burrito, tostada, and I got a fish taco with extra sour cream on there, because that's how I like it. I'm about to smash this. I am so hungry. But if you like burritos and Mexican food in general, and you're not subscribed, what are you doing with your life, dude? And, um... Thank you, God, for being in cheese burrito. Sorry, y'all. I had to start with this one because it was just it was just calling my name. I didn't work out today. It's my first meal. Give me a break. I'm gonna say this to start off, Tapatio number two. This is a fine bean and cheese burrito. Again, I kind of got similar burritos, so you know, I can kind of compare uh, the restaurants. I, I kind of want to go to like all the different Mexican restaurants, but I'm, I'm just gonna do this. This is very <laughs> And since it's Tapatio number two, would you take a bite of that? I need a chip As I have all of these, my guy. Okay. Okay, so that was like a really fast start, but I was really hungry. I'm gonna cool it off with a uh, fish taco. Now, I don't think I've ever had a fish taco with melted cheese on it. Um, usually the cheese is kind of, what is it, uncooked. And um, let's just try. Mmm, tilapia, um, can you see it? There it is, there's your tilapia. Come on, try their salsa verde. Wow, really? Why subscribe to this guy?
I swear I had a fish taco right there. That's the weirdest thing. Hmm. No, but in all actuality, that was actually delicious. It was almost like, a, remind me of like a burrito with sour cream in it. The tilapia was cooked really well. Delicious. Okay. So, since it's about six o'clock, let's go for the breakfast burrito. And when I say six o'clock, I mean at night. This is their chorizo egg, um, hash brown. Dude. That chorizo is packed with flavor, a little spicy. Mm. I like the hash brown in there. Uh, the meat and the hash brown are the main players in this, but their burrito um, tortillas. I really like, they're like, almost like thick, like it's hard to pull. Now with a little tapatio. I see what they did. There's bacon in here, but it's super fine. Like, like, fine, like, minced. Okay, it does not want to focus. See it? Yeah, so it's like tiny little pieces, but I'm gonna take some of my cheese right here from uh, my bean and cheese burrito, make a little donation to the breakfast burrito fund. Mm -hmm. That is great. The extra cheese did the trick. Um, so, fun little story. Um, I got my first dentist appointment in about two years today. Two years, last time was before I started my channel. Guys, peep this. Guess how many cavities I have. I want you to comment down below a number. I'm gonna say it at the end of the video. No, don't scroll to the end of the video. Watch it and you know find out. I'm gonna say it at the end of the video, okay? Actually I'm not. For everybody that just went to the end of the video, I'm not. I'm gonna say it pretty soon, okay? So that was uh, um pretty good, pretty good. Needed a little beans and cheese though. Mm. So it turns out I only have one cavity. Get that. Brush and floss twice a day. Al Pastor burrito. Rice, beans, cheese, cilantro. Bro. That Al Pastor Look at that.
Dude, the seasoning on that Al Pastor is incredible. It's, um, yeah, it's, it's spicy, but it has this grill flavor to it that, um, wow. Guacamole peeping out. Let's get a little guac on it just because. That was beautiful. Why are Al Pastor burritos always gone so fast? Oh yeah. Oh, also, I didn't print out a seat again, a receipt, but everything was around $62. Which is pretty good. About $10 a burrito. Um, anyways, I'm talking too much. Let's go on to the toast salad. And everybody there was so nice. I just gotta say that. Very kind. Nice. Chicken tostada. Or tostada con pollo. Uh, frijoles. No, arroz, guacamole. It looks like pico de gallo. I was gonna put the... That's what I'm doing. Now let's take a bite. Lord, dude. Okay, I'm not I'm not gonna even sorry to bother you guys with that. The chicken is super tender. And the onions break up the heavy flavor. That is delicious. Mmm. I love a tostada. Tostada and uh long story short, I was wrong. Ooh, oh, that's gonna be such a good bite. We still got refried beans and cheese, hot Cheetos. And the guacamole. Okay. Now this burrito is the one more bite. Can you guess what that is? I'll put it there for you. Can you guess what that is? And if you guess carne asada burrito with refried beans, cheese, um, guacamole, you would be correct. No rice. <clears throat> 
Okay, again, we got another creamy guac today. With good tortilla chips. Sometimes that's all you need. Also, some um, burrito fell down. Beef tostada, carne asada tostada. Okay. And carne asada is pretty much grilled meat because carne is meat and asada is grilled. So if you didn't know, now you know. Wait. I think this is their salsa caliente. I could eat this every day. I could eat this every single day. Um. So like, but your boy, his cooking can't touch this. This is just like the meat, the savoriness of this carne asada in here. And everything just comes together and you can tell that whoever made this knows what they're doing. I'm gonna get another bite of this though. Taco Bell calls this. But I guess if we go like that. Whatever. We're not talking about Taco Bell today. Here, right now. Mm -mm. Mm. But yeah. Loki, this is my celebration meal. For only having one cavity. In the last two years. Um, Pretty big. You know, considering. I mean, I kind of knew I was fine because I take really good care of my teeth and all that. Hygiene is chill. True story. Mm. I think somebody's on their way to have their own. Mm. Thumbs up, comment nacho down below if one day you want to see a video of like a huge stack of nachos. Cause throw some carne asada, some birria meat on there. Oh man. Oh my God. You know what, too? Mm. This restaurant, Tapatio number two, and the last place I went to, and most of the Me Mexican restaurants that have been on the channel, like, I've never experienced chewy meat before. Like, you know, carne asada when it's like rubber, it's never happened. And this, today, perfectly tender, easy to eat, Vibin. Also, what's your favorite hot Cheeto flavor? Comment below. I love them on. Mm. Okay. 
hype toast out of time. Oh my god, their chicken is so good. <laughs> It's perfectly tender, it's cubed. Bonk. 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 Guacamole on there, refried beans. Cheese. Some guac fell down here, don't worry. Another one, guys. Another one. Another absolutely delicious, fantastic Mexican celebration because my teeth is good. Well, somewhat good. My dentist is the man though, so. Updated holiday, Mexican food Monday. So now that you know, go out, celebrate it. But I wanna know what your favorite from the meal was. And if you love burritos and you love Mexican food in general, but you're not subscribed, what are you doing with your life, dude? We got many more celebrations to come and more holidays to make because I can. So keep those notification bells on and I will catch you in the next video. Peace Magic Gang, you rock. We got burritos. Let's get into this. Give me one second, hold on. This is the bean and cheese. I love a bean and cheese burrito. Wow. Let me just put this right here really quick. I got something extra. Check this out. Hot Cheetos. Bonk.